and see if we actually have a hard day's night. And sure enough, there it is. And it's all going to start it's up and play. Well, that is most definitely the Beatles. So that sort of gives you a kind of quick overview of the mp3tunes.com uh, website. Let's take a look at their associated website, which is at sideload.com. So here is www.sideload.com, and this site uh, is basically organizing uh, a set of music into a variety of categories, including featured tracks, most popular tracks, uh, newest tracks, uh, the tracks alphabetically listed here, and in fact you can search for a particular artist or track uh, in this search box. And with the idea that with all any one of these songs uh, can then be uh, sideloaded into your locker. So uh, let's click on, uh, let's say under featured tracks, let's click on this one, Hercules and Love Affair. And so we get sent to a track details page, which among other things has the artist, Hercules and Love Affair, the track, Hercules theme. Uh, and it includes a bunch of capabilities, including uh, listening to the track. Why don't we listen to it a bit? Okay, I guess you get the, uh, the idea. We could actually download this song to our own machine. Here's the download link down here. If I click download. You see my little download thing? Well, it's downloaded almost instantaneously. And uh, if I click on this, uh, double click, it'll start up iTunes. And iTunes uh, appears and starts to play Hercules theme. So it's loaded. I guess we can stop it and uh, kind of minimize uh, iTunes and get rid of the download window. Uh, now, in addition to playing it and downloading it, you notice they list uh, the source. This is actually the uh, location where this file was obtained, namely at emichrysalis.co.uk. So that's the EMI uh, Chrysalis Company in the United Kingdom. And uh, that's actually not the file. That's just the domain. If I move my cursor down to download this track and ho hover over it, you'll see down at the bottom here on the status bar, let me do it again, the actual name of the file, which is at emichrysalis.co.uk slash Hercules and Love Affair slash downloads slash 1611.07 slash Hercules theme dot mp3. And so uh, why don't we perhaps go to that uh, well, why don't we start, yeah, why don't we go to that page. Here I have it in here. So here's the actual location for the file. And you'll notice that fronting the MP3 file is a form that says to download your free track and hear the latest Hercules and Love Affair news, listings, comps, and prizes. Simply sign up below for the official mailing list. So it's attempting to get a forename and a surname and a gender and an address and a bunch of information. Uh, and of course, this thing uh, no longer connects. I can submit, okay, they want all my details. Uh, I guess I could enter a couple of details. Uh, I am a male and I guess uh, some sort of address will do. Uh, Los Angeles, California, 0272, I guess, uh, United States, where are we? Uh, let's see if submit will work. Well, they really want everything. Uh, uh, date of birth. Wow. All right. I didn't know I was going to have to enter all this stuff. Uh, I know, should we really be honest? Uh, all right, let's give my email address. This should finally do it. And of course, 
we don't get anything but the page back again. So uh, this is an old page and it's been disconnected. However, uh, you can see that sideload, going back to sideload, still actually manages to offer the song on the download track because it does retain the URL directly to the MP3 file. In addition, I can also sideload this track directly to my locker using the link and I get a very similar kind of form as I had before. Clicking on send will go and upload it. The side load is in progress. May take a few minutes. Let's see if it does. And, and the side load is complete. Hercules theme.mp3 has been uploaded. So let's get rid of that. And I guess we could go back to the locker. Maybe we could sort of refresh. And uh, let's bring it down. And there we are, Hercules theme right at the top. And I think it's about to start up. There it goes. So uh, I guess the one other thing we might do on uh, uh, the sideload.com site is perhaps use the search box. Here's the search box in the upper right. Why don't we enter a query like Beatles? See what we get. OK, well, we get uh, not only one complete page, of results we actually get two three four five pages of results let's here's the second page see let it be for example hard days night uh, go to the third page uh, flying getting better glass onion helter skelter here comes the sun let's go to the fourth page so you can see they've got quite a few uh, Beatles songs why don't we try one of them how about yesterday so let's click on this one. We get another track details page. We can listen to the song. Yesterday, all my troubles seem so far away. OK, that's definitely Paul McCartney singing uh, Yesterday. And uh, once again, I could sideload this into my locker. I could uh, download the track. And uh, you can see that this is the actual source location where they got it. Uh, and uh, this hovering over this actually gives you the complete uh, link to the MP3 file. And that concludes uh, the demonstration of the mp3tunes.com uh, website and the sideload.com website.